What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Brendan, and I'm BMANX45, and today we're coming at you with another video. We have our first two box openings for BT17 Secret Crisis of the Digimon TCG. We have our pre-release stuff. We have eight boxes to go through, eight chances to pull low pull rates, some sweet alts, and maybe get through all our supers that we want for this each set. But uh, we're going to get into it. We're going to open these boxes, see what kind of cool box toppers we pull. There's lots of box toppers in here. And we're going to go through and upload these double box openings throughout the week here. So uh, if you enjoy this type of content, be sure to smash that like button. Comment down below. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell for notifications. So you don't miss a single minute of the fun. Without further ado, let's get into it. We're going to open these boxes. As always, I have my handy dandy knife here. We have Jesse Bessie here uh, to help us get through these boxes as quick as possible and hopefully to pull the nuts because she usually pulls better than I do. Uh, I don't know if we can top two Mastimon uh, Ace low pull rates like we did last set. Uh, doesn't seem like it's possible, but we're sure as heck going to try. I don't even know which the best uh, pull is for low pull rates in this set, but we'll see if we can pull some low pull rates and maybe... Get them sold right away before the prices go down. Pre-release is the best time uh, to get stuff sold because everything is just so much higher in terms of price. Um, there's three, I believe, three box topper packs in each box. So we'll see in a second here. Yeah, we have the Secret Crisis Movie Memorial Pack. We have the Update Pack. And we have the Box Topper Promotion Pack. So three promotion packs, uh, hoping for some good stuff. We'll see what we get. But let's get into it. All right, so for our first pack, got to remember to be gentle with the sides. Uh, we have a full art Ty and Kari as our first one for that pack. That was the uh, promotion, box promotion pack or the box topper pack. Uh, next, I'm going to go with the update pack here. We got a Falcomon. Ooh, these are nice foiled out cards. Falcomon promo. Uh, we got a uh, Minami Uihara. I can't even remember which one she's from, honestly, uh, as our other box topper pack. For our other um, update pack, we got Flame Dramon. Nice. I'm liking the foiling on these. They look really good. And then for our uh, movie memorial pack, we got a Jedi. So that's kind of cool. And we got a Rika. All right. Let's get into the packs. And as always, we're mostly hoping to get stuff to build our decks right away so that we can start testing uh, decks. Those decks being Red Hybrid, um, Red Hybrid, uh, oh, there we go, Diaboromon, and a Super Rare Eosmon to start off the game, and a Rare Diaboromon. We're looking for Diaboromon stuff. We want to build uh, or fix up our Diaboromon deck. We want to build Red Hybrid. We want to build. Um, we want to add Paladin mode to our Imperial Dramon deck, so we're looking for that as well. We probably, I definitely want to build either Shine or Sukuyamon, so either one of those would be really great to get stuff from. Um, Gallantmon and an Ancient Garurumon. I mean, two, su two supers right out of the bat. Um, there's also... What is, um, the Diaboromon, um, we need the Antilamons, uh, which is just a common, or yeah, I think it's just a common, so it's gonna be, we're gonna get a play set automatically from like, just, just from the boxes. We we get these two boxes uh, for our Cherubimon deck and uh, interested in Dex Doru stuff. Uh, we got a Koji and a Tai. Looks like we have an alt art from Jess's stuff. Get into that. We have a Sukuyamon. Uh, we have an Ancient Garurumon alt, which is funny because I, uh, she, I think she also looks like, I don't know. I thought she pulled a, 
Ancient Greymon. We do want Ancient Greymon, so Ancient Gurumon. It's just funny is because that's like the deck that I'm not necessarily interested in. Or Gray, Agumon, Parasite Mon. Uh, we also got a Super Armageddon Mon. That's for our Diabora Mon, so we want to see those. We only need one of those, so that's not too bad. Uh, Davis and Ken and a Sakuyamon. I just love how we got a Davis and Ken last set, so we've got a Davis and Ken two sets in a row. Um, it's just funny that I, I was hoping for the Ancient Greymon alt, so the fact that we got the Ancient Gurumon alt would make it even better is if we don't get a Takuya alt, but we get a Koji alt would be actually kind of funny since I, I've never really been super uh, excited or, or wanting to build blue hybrids. I don't know why, just, just how I feel. Um, Parasite Mon and Gabumon. But we're uh, th three supers in and one alt. Okay. And lots of stuff for the decks. There's that Antilamon we want to see. Uh, War Gray and Taikari. We have a Fenrir Lugamon. Ooh, we have a alt secret Fenrir Lugamon ta uh, Takami, Takami Kazuchi, I think is how it's pronounced. Uh, so f f right off the bat, we pulled the alt secret, so that's really cool. Uh, we got a Gabumon, Parrotmon, Parasitemon, Melgarumon, uh, Taikari, Koji. So that's actually kind of cool. So uh, both alts. From uh, from Jess's box have been have been found um, right off the bat. Uh, what do we got here? Um, Gallantmon and Takuya. Some more stuff here. Parrotmon, Takato. Agumon, we got our first Ancient Greymon. That's great. We want to see this guy. Uh, of course, Fenrir Lugamon. And a Metal Garumon. We still got a lot of good supers that we can go through. Uh, We got a Shine Greymon and a Fenrir Lugamon. And we have a Shine Greymon, another one, and a Burst a Shine Greymon and a Burst Mode in the same pack. That's actually really cool. Uh, so we got a Burst Mode, which is we do are interested in the Shine Greymon line. I think it's kind of cool, the whole Burst Mode Ace thing. Um, and I love how it's like kind of gone back to a yellow variant, but you can definitely play the red variant in it as well to make it good because uh, I like it as more of a yellow focused deck. Uh, we got Gallantmon, we got Diaboramon. Interesting set, definitely interesting set. A lot of ace cards, a lot of supers kind of where not where I thought there would be supers. Um, so we'll have to keep an eye on that. Uh, what do we got here? Matt and Ty and Leon Alexander. Sometimes you can get the packs to crack really easily and sometimes you can't. Uh, Morphmon and Takato. But sometimes you just can't. Okay. Uh, Marcus and a Golfmon. I like that the rest of the Shine Graham online is is just solid yellow, but the Marcus is still red yellow. That's kind of cool. Uh, Sakuyamon, Morphmon, the Oromon. Tomo Nori Resenji, Tai Tamer, we got a Super Kazuchimon, Agumon, Leon Alexander, 
We got Golfmon, Shine Greymon, Parrotmon. We got an Omnimon Ace. That's nice. That's another good super. Uh, I think we've got two of the Ace cards so far. Still have a bunch more Ace cards. Still haven't pulled a single Paladin mode or a um, what's the other guy? Uh, Gallantmon. Uh, so we got uh, Takuya and Tono Tomo Nori. Uh, we have ooh, we got Dex Doru Super. That's cool. Golfmon. Uh, we got a Gallantmon Crimson Mode Ace as a Super. That's really good. And Mel Durumon. So we got three out of the four Aces from these two boxes. Haven't seen any double ups yet. I don't believe. We've got five more supers that we can come across. Uh, Shine Greymon and Golfmon. There's our first double up. Uh, Leon Alexander and another Omnimon Ace. Agumon and a Leon Alexander. Jess is already through her whole box. We'll have to give her some packs. Uh, more Greymon, Tai, Kari, Parasite Mon, Gabu Mon, Koji Minamoto, Tai, Marcus, and Davis. Hopefully, pull some of those white Greymons. I don't know what they're going to be good in, if they're, but they look really, really cool. The nice white Greymon. We got an Argomon Super. That's the first one of that. Takuya. Jess sounds like Jess got one of my alts. Uh, alt Eosmon is our third alt. Uh, Koji. So we have one, and we could potentially see a low pull rate. Do uh, Boromon and. That guy, Tomonori, another second Gallimon Crimson Mode. Okay. Ah, oh, we got an Alt Pulsemon as our uh, as our fourth Alt. So we got an Alt Pulsemon. Haven't pulled a regular Pulsemon. Ooh, we got Paladin mode. That's first for Paladin mode, so that's good. Takato. Uh, we got a War Gray and a regular Pulse Mon. So we do have a regular Pulse Mon, so that's good. I think only like five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I think that's it. That's it for our supers. We should, unless we got a low pull rate. I don't know if a low pull rate is extra or if it takes the spot of something you'll have to uh, marcus and a davis uh, and then a kuyamon and a morphmon so 14 supers like usual seven per box uh the chance of two alts uh, or an alt and a secret like usual um pretty good ratios we only doubled up on two cards i believe which was the omnimon and the gallant mon so uh, that would mean we got 12. Yeah, that would mean we got 12 supers, which is the number of supers. Uh, you know, if I, if, I, if I am correct, that would be, yeah, 12 supers. So we pulled one of those two boxes. We pulled one of each super. So if that continues with these boxes, we will complete play sets. Um, so that's really great. And then two, two of them were, were double ups. So that's actually really cool. So uh, 
That was really, really cool. The I like uh, pulling the secret alt right off the bat. Not sure how I feel about Pulsemon or Eosmon. Uh, Ancient Guru Mon's kind of cool, but not the one I'm really looking for. And the box toppers are great. I'm, I'm loving the box toppers. So we're going to get more box openings happening here. Thank you guys for checking it out. Looks like that's all the time we have for this video. Thank you very much for tuning in, and we hope to see you in the next video. And as always, have a wonderful day. And that's all for now, folks.